Top of the morning all, Andy at ACCB. Grey market minute for your Wednesday. Overnight futures are up again, and we saw gas come in last night and bought by 495,000 tonnes a week. That's a pretty big purchase on that one, so they've got a bit of an appetite there. Uh, here in Australia, again, we're all looking at the weather maps and the frosting maps as well. We haven't quite established what damage has been done. That will be established over the coming days, and that will see where the market uh, is going to take its turn from. What we are seeing is a lot of bids in the market as well, and the offer side is probably just enough away out of reach for the bids to reach up and get, grab them. We saw the uh, Dowling Downs week, January yesterday, that was bid at $448 a tonne. Now I was hearing that it was trading in those low 450s, so that's an interesting one to watch as well. The new crop sorghum as well, that was another one. Heard that yesterday trading at $400 a tonne track for the Brisbane uh, track market. We had that offered yesterday and the bids were just a little bit subdued. They didn't want to jump up there late yesterday afternoon. Um, the southern market as well was a hard one to sort of pin down at the moment. From what I can make out, the SW1 delivered into Melbourne Geelong is getting very close to import parity out of West Australia. So that's the entire east coast now, if that's going to work, from Melbourne, Port Kembla, Newcastle, Brisbane, all pricing off WA for the time being. The one thing that we're lacking, of course, is free on truck offers going forward for the January, and that's making it difficult to ascertain what the interior market's going to start pricing. So that's one thing we've got to keep an eye out for and start seeing those if they come along. Anything you want to work in the market today? do let me know. Have yourselves a great day and I'll talk to you soon. See you all. Bye.